What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius back at it again with another episode of Spy Family, Spy Family Episode 9. This one is called Show Off How in Love You Are. We already know what that means. I am very, very excited. Before we get into anything, I do want to let you guys know that uh, as you guys can see with the new headphones, I do have an entirely new mixer. I have an entirely new audio setup in general, so a lot of settings had to be changed. I only let you guys know this just in case there's any audio issues for the next upcoming videos or episodes. Just bear with me for a little bit while we have this all tinkered and balanced out. So I appreciate your guys' patience. But with that being said, we ended with a major cliffhanger. Will they kiss? What will happen? I am very excited to find out. I say we hop right on into it. Don't forget, with the other shows we're watching on the channel, you guys can get early access and full length. You can also get full length for this one, completely uncut, over on the Patreon. Links are down below for that. Make sure you guys go check that out. Also, subscribe, click that bell so you guys always know when I post over here on the Dapper channel. Go check out the other social medias, Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, all at Dapper Darius. Much appreciated, y'all. Let's hop right on into this. Spy Family, Episode 9, Show Off How In Love You Are. Let's do it. If you're really married, then prove it to me. Wait, has she not had her first kiss yet? Taste-wise, yeah, I get it. Marinated. <laughs> come on, come on yo. She wants to get drunk before anything happens. Okay, she's committed. Okay, okay, spy family. Okay, okay, okay. I actually think yours is one of my favorite waifus of all time, so I'm a little. I know, right? I'm a little like Yuri right now. I'm like. You're the one who wanted this, Yuri. <laughs> that was quite the slap. That was quite the slap. <laughs> yeah, I would think so too, Anya. To be honest, I would take that slap any day from your. Oh my god. It's all fitting part of the plan. I mean, this definitely is proving to Yuri that they're married. I, I was a fool to test you. You're definitely married. <laughs> Yuri's about to die of blood loss. <laughs> I know. <laughs> like, my man is having forks thrown at him. <laughs> No, he just Yeah He's like me, he knows you guys are adorable Always got each other's backs But I've got her back too You're not alone in this, buddy We both have her best interests in heart Now obviously he's playing an act for the spy But there's some part of genuineness to that and he's out of here. Feel free to come over anytime, man. Good to see you. It was hilarious on my perspective to have you over, so feel free to come over as well, Yuri. Yeah, I do wonder what you would think of Anya. <laughs> he was gonna say executed. <laughs> For some reason, I thought he was going to say excommunicated like they were in a church, but no, he meant the full nine yards. I know. That's what I'm saying. This man could go. Okay. They're all having their own dreams. That's adorable. Meanwhile, dad is up getting his knowledge down. I love how this is not only wholesome action-packed, spy-filled, but also has great development. I love how they have their own colors for them, with their teacups, with their cups for their toothbrushes as well. So adorable. 
Unki. Oh god, this is not what Anya needs to know. Now Anya's like, oh, okay, this is crazy. Okay, yep. Yeah. 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 I get where he's having he's not being suspicious of her yet but he's having second doubts and I understand that especially with the coincidence that her brother is like literally an arch nemesis to him so I understand it but I can't oh don't say it okay yeah I mean did you see that breakfast you know I can't wait for him to find out she's an assassin you know it's gonna be very interesting it's gonna be very interesting Obviously, is not that, but I get why she would think that. They are very observant people. I, I, I do respect that about both of them. Obviously, Lloyd's a great spy. Obviously, she's an assassin. Being observant is a benefit in your line of work, but still. Right, Anya. I firmly agree. You tell him. Even kids without telepathy can tell when their parents are a little awkward to each other, you know? So, <laughs> it's, it's fully understandable Anya saying that. You said, stop worrying about your sister's husband, worrying about Twilight. Little does they do, do they know that Twilight is uh, his sister's husband. This is going to be quite interesting when shit hits the fan. It really will. Like, when this hits this climax, I'm very excited. She's asking for relationship advice. This should put your... This should put your suspicions at ease, right? I mean, he's never even kissed, you know? I like the guy on the left design, but we know the guy on the right is friends with Yuri, so... This is... okay. No wonder I like the guy on the left design. This is the move Twilight was talking about. And he... Okay, I thought, okay. That's Twilight. <laughs> Alright, Frankie. <laughs> I know. We've seen his acting before. He gets into it. He, this is a... This is a fair plan from Twilight if she was on Yuri's side and knew that and was trying to expose everything, you know? This is a Yor we know and love right here. Oh! Okay. Hemorrhoid doctor? Okay. Okay. But I must say, you can't have a wife better than Yor in terms of looking out for you. Like, be quiet about this for her sake as well because of his hemorrhoids. But I tell you, Yor is the GOAT. Shouts out to her. Frankie's reminding not only him but us as well. We know that's gonna happen. I mean, yours is an amazing woman. Anya's an amazing girl. Come on. Taking the bug off her. Damn. I feel bad for her. I agree. 
I agree. Too many people are worried about the societal appearances, you know? Bro. We're already putting on an act literally 24-7. So how about you just be yourself, you know? I, I think that's the best answer Twilight could have given, you know? Stop worrying about what you think a wife or a mother should be like. We love you for just who you are. Oh, I'm telling you. I'm telling you. One day, they're going to mean that, and it's not going to be in a pretend way. They're going to mean, like, genuinely, you know? You can already tell. She can tell that the vibes are much different. She's not only reading their mind, but like I said, kids in general can just tell when their parents are like that, you know? I love their colors. You got tea, coffee, who knows? I love it. That was a great episode. Thoroughly was. Well, that was a fantastic episode. I thoroughly enjoyed how it ended with the Yuri, your Twilight kiss, because I thought it was going to happen. Yor said, if I'm going to do this, I need to get drunk. And in that being the case, she couldn't do it. Slapping Yuri by accident, but making it seem like it all fit. It was a huge misunderstanding, but it all fit for the story perfectly. It was hilarious. Yuri is convinced that Twilight is a con, that Lloyd is a con man and a bad guy, but also knows deep down he's a good guy. Uh, Yor and Lloyd, obviously. You obviously Lloyd was a little bit suspicious after the coincidence that you know, obviously, but his suspicions were definitely quelled this episode, and I'm very glad by that. It took a little bit of dirty work in order to do that. And Frankie said, Don't feel bad, you know, you're a spy, don't develop feelings, which I do. We don't, we do feel that you know, he's going to be developing feelings, she's developing feelings, Anya is already developing feelings. It all started with their own individual agenda and motive, but now it is, is developing to something much, much further. And I'm thoroughly, I'm here for it. I'm here for it. I love them as a couple. I love Yor in general, Lloyd in general, um, Anya in general. So I can't wait to not only ha continue the story with Anya and Desmond in school and the actual context of the actual plot of the show, you know, uh, saving the world, all this, the spy, all that. But I also cannot, cannot wait. It's kind of like we have a spy, a slice of life school with our daughter thing for half the show and the other half the show is a romance rom-com slice of life with Yor and Lloyd. And oh my God, can I not wait for them to have 75 kids together? It's going to be amazing. So very excited. I thoroughly enjoyed this episode. Hopefully you guys did as well. If you did, please leave a like. Let me know your thoughts down below. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell. Like I said, so you guys always know when I post over here on the Dapper channel. Check out that Patreon for early access and full length of the other shows I'm watching. I appreciate y'all. Don't forget to drink some water. Tell someone you love them. Have a great day, Dapper Squad. Peace.